using the array reverse method, you can, as the name says it, reverse an array, meaning that the first element will become the last and the last will become the first. And also the middle ones will reverse them, obviously. Let's see how that works in code. We have a numbers array, which has the numbers from one to five, and we're going to call the reverse method on this array. And now if for console.log, if you're logging the numbers, we get five, four, three, two, one. So the reversed array. Keep in mind that this changes the original array. If you don't want to change the original array, you can store the new array and create a shallow copy of this array using the concat method. And now you can see that the numbers array is the same, but if you're logging the new array also, we get the second array being reversed. Or you can use the spread operator instead of the concat. And now it basically is the same thing. You're creating a new array and you're reversing the elements inside the array. Another use case for this method is if you want to reverse the characters inside of a string. So let's remove this, clear the console. Um, and now let's create a string, which will say coding is fun. And let's reverse this string. How are we going to do that is let's store it in another variable a result. We're going to split the string in an array of characters, providing an uh, empty string here. We're going to use the reverse method to reverse that array and then we can use the join method to join back the array inside of a string. And now if we're console.logging the result, we will get this string which is reversed. That's it for this tutorial, I hope you liked it and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!